More than 100 people were buried today in front of a small crowd of strangers. As Anchor Rural Day shows us, it's a way to give the seemingly forgotten a dignified burial. Flowers for Charles Trujillo, Eva Gomez, John Gray. Today, the remains of 135 people were buried on the city's southwest side. People no family came to claim or people whose families could not afford a burial. Many of our brothers and sisters that we honor today were lonely. Uh, they were ill. And they were left to the devices of what can be a cold, cruel world. This gathering was a way to offer James Fish, Joe Archuleta, Thomas Dunn a dignified burial. Their loved ones were not here to cry or mourn, but strangers did come here to say goodbye. We're here because we believe, because we believe, and we want to show some love, and there's nothing we can give them, but we can give them our spirit, our care, our prayers. Pete Tafoya, Richard Lee, Kelly Adams all had their own story, and as some said at the service, they believe these people had a similar ending. The Lord takes us at our best, and so everybody that's in this book, the Lord took at their very best. Vincent Carson, William Forrester, Peggy Chavez now rest at the Evangelico Cemetery with a proper headstone to mark their place in our community. Well, Riverside Funeral Home donated the plot and the casket for today's service. And the county does these burials every two years because they must list the names of the deceased in case someone comes forward to claim them. Back to you. People in Santa Fe are